If you want to get a good quality watches under $5,000 according to your needs, then watch the video till the end and then decide. There is a mix of brands and models in the under $5,000 price point for watches. These are 10 of our current favorite men's watches under $5,000 in no particular order. This list can continue to grow as there are quite a few brands and models and it can be hard to narrow it to just 10. So let's get started. At number one position, we have Rolex Oyster Perpetual Date, a brand that can be hard to find in the sub $5,000 price point. The Rolex Oyster Perpetual Date is a classic design from the luxury watch brand. The Oyster Perpetual is known for being water resistant and a utility watch. The blue dial of this model makes it both casual and dressy. The three link Oyster bracelet is a comfortable design and one synonymous with Rolex. The sporty yet dressy watch makes this a perfect starter watch or something that works for a one-watch collection. It has a 100 m water resistance and can be worth casually or more dressed up. It is a perfect to all watch in the under $5,000 market. Moving on to the next at number two with Omega Speedmaster. Rounding out our list is another Omega, this time being the Speedmaster. While there are a few different options that can be found under $5,000, one in particular stands out as a must-have in this price point. The Moonwatch is the watch able to boast the title first watch on the moon and was first introduced in 1957 with the Broad Arrow reference. This model features a 40 tomb case and includes the distinction of professional on the dial. The look of the Speedmaster Professional has been largely unchanged over the last 50 years and features a black dial with Hesselite crystal. The Speedmaster Professional Moonwatch is an iconic watch that new and seasoned collectors lust after and is NASA approved. The number three position is held by Tudor Black Bay. The Tudor Black Bay Bronze is another unique watch under $5,000. And within the Black Bay family, there are a few different options within this price point. The collection was launched in 2012 as a modern update to the Tudor Submariner design. The Bronze iteration is the first time Tudor made a dive watch with solid bronze. The model features a 200 m water resistance and can be found with different strap and dial or bezel combinations. Being a 43 in bronze watch, this model has some major risk presence. Similar to the bronze Oris, we started this list with the bronze case of this watch will pattern over time, especially if worn in the water. The large luminous Arabic numerals, dot hour markers, and large hour and minute hands also make this an easy read in the dark or when diving. Next at number four, we have IWC Pilot Spitfire. IWC is known for its high quality pilot watches, and this bronze Pilot Spitfire is no exception. This 39M automatic watch features a unique color scheme. The bronze case is complemented by a brown leather strap and green dial, also giving it a military feel. The crown is slightly oversized, although not as large as other IWC models. The case back is in homage to the original Spitfire as an engraving of the plane design. The number five position is held by Omega Seamaster Diver 300. The Seamaster Diver 300 is a watch that needs no introduction and is also the model that James Bond wore in the early 1990s. It is a well-known model from the iconic brand Omega. Similar to other watches on our list, the Seamaster Diver can be found in a few different variations of dial colors and complications, all under $5,000. This includes the newer release blue ceramic bezel with laser engraved wave dial, the Diver 300 chronograph, and older versions of the classic Diver. Depending on the model, you can find different case sizes, but most have two distinct features, the wave dial and helium release valve. The model boasts a 300 m water resistance even in the chronograph variation. The five-link bracelet is both sturdy and comfortable and features a diving extension. Depending on the model, the watch can also be found on a rubber strap. The number six position is dominated by Breitling Transocean Chronograph. Breitling is a long-standing history in watchmaking, in particular. The brand has become well-known for superior pilot watches. The original Transocean was released in 1958, and the family was revived in 2010 featuring a vintage design influence. The 43 in case is a modern update to the classic design. The watch is also powered by the bone and house automatic movement with a 70-hour power reserve. The Transocean chronograph is an easy-to-read tri-register chronograph with contrasted dial. The bone movement powering this watch is also C O S C certified, providing an extra layer of reliability and an affordable timepiece. 
Moving on to the next at number 7 with Grand Seiko Heritage Spring Drive Soko Special Edition. For a classic approach to a dress watch, an iconic Grand Seiko model, the SP Gay 4D7 features a contrasting green second and power reserve hand. This special edition watch was released as part of a collection inspired by the seasons and was for the U.S. Grand Seiko market. The SP Gay 4D7 references inspired by the late autumn season in Japan's bamboo forest with a play of light and shadow on the dial texture. The green accents represent the color of these forests. The spring drive movement utilizes a speed control mechanism, blending quartz with automatic watch features. This allows the watch to deliver next level precision and keep back your time. You can see the movement through the exhibition case back. That's all for today. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for the upcoming video notification.